For most commanders assigned to the Army Material Command's depots and arsenals, in many cases it's their first time in a production environment and their first time working primarily with a large civilian workforce. And because this environment is so unique, uh, so different from the uh, operational uh, green-suited Army type of units that they've been associated with in the past, they might be one of only three uniform members at their depot or arsenal. What did I show you in new orders yesterday? Six billion in, in, you know, basically a year in business. That's why this week-long Army Working Capital Fund Commander's course on Redstone Arsenal is so important. The course helps commanders understand the complexity of the Working Capital Fund, the key terms used in the business, and it helps commanders develop a strategic level view of how it supports the Army and other DOD components. They have to understand the financial aspect of running the business, and this course is focused on that, teaching them how a revolving fund, which is the Army Working Capital Fund, how it operates and how it supports their business. And that's essentially what the Army Working Capital is, a huge billion dollar business run by AMC a business that's tasked with providing service and support for readiness and sustainability of the Army and war fighting forces. This is a $10 billion enterprise every year supporting both supply activities and industrial operations. For commanders who've never been a part of a production environment, getting up to speed quickly is crucial. When you think of AMC and you think of uh, America's insurance policy and the, and, the, and the capabilities of the organic industrial base. That in organic industrial base is financed by working capital funds. From the Army Material Command's Public Affairs Office, I'm Joseph Givens.